God took care of Ruth and Naomi, so I know he'll take care of me and my homies. Welcome, everybody, to the Jay Sadie Variety Show, and praise the Lord. Well, howdy, y'all. I'm Jay Sadie Gray, and I'm here with my sister, Lenny. Isn't that right, Lenny? That's right, Sadie. Well, today, we're talking about whistling. But first, we have Phyllis Heil whistling Amazing Grace. ago, Lenny and I lived up a holler in the hills of East Tennessee. The house where we lived faced a mountain called Tater Knob. They called it that because it looked like a huge pile of potatoes till there was just one on top, and it was a spectacular view in the fall. We didn't always have a car to take us to church, so we walked. It wasn't quite an eighth of a mile to the church. So we would walk out of the holler, and it would still be daylight. But after church, it would be dark. Our grandma would bring a flashlight, because walking back into the holler, it was pitch black. <laughs> there were no street lights in the country, you know. Well, one time, we got halfway up in the holler, and the flashlight batteries died. We could barely make out each other, so we held hands. I wanted to whistle a tune to help me be calm and not afraid. The only problem with that was I didn't know how to whistle. So I tried to hum to show whatever varmint was out there I wasn't afraid, that I was carefree, and maybe they would be afraid of me. Well, with Grandma in the lead, we made it home in the dark. Well, years later, I learned there is something better than whistling in the dark, and that's the Lord. He will lead us like Grandma led us. We need to speak His Word. One verse I use is 2 Timothy 1.7. For God hath not given us a spirit of fear, but of power and of love and of a sound mind. I speak that out loud. So I can hear it, and his word is calming. 
I thought about Ruth and Naomi crossing the desert. You know, the desert didn't have any street lights either. But the one thing they had going for them was that one true God. They relied on him and he didn't fail them. You know, the power of darkness is all around us, but the Lord is our light. If you want that light, just pray this prayer with me. Dear Heavenly Father, please forgive me of my sins. I believe Jesus is your son and that he died on the cross and rose from the dead. Please light up my life. In Jesus' name, amen. If you believe in your heart what you prayed, you're saved. Thank the Lord. What will help you is to read the Bible daily so his word makes your light brighter. Isn't that right, Lenny? That's right, Sadie. Well, we've got another whistling song for you. Here is Keith Getty with his tin whistle playing in Christ Alone. poem time on the program we've got another one by deborah ann this is titled perfect love casts away sin i felt the trap of anxiety set a snare on my sanity the conditions were just right that at my heart it took a swipe i took the bait ran away with it then fell into a nervous snit. I whistle at the dark, trying to show evil that I'm smart. It took some time for me to see this isn't where God wants me. So I set my own trap with anxiety. Now with God's love, fear has no priority. First John 4.18 inspired Deborah Ann to write this poem, and it states, there is no fear in love, but perfect love casts away fear, because fear hath torment. He that feareth is not made perfect in love. And that was the King James Version. Well, we are about out of time. Isn't that right, Lenny? That's right, Sadie. We want to thank you for listening. We have you in our prayers. By the way, if you have a prayer request you'd like us to pray about, just private message us on Facebook at J. Sadie Gray, G-R-A-Y, or on our website at jsadiegray.com. Also on our website is our monthly blog and a link to our YouTube channel where our radio programs are archived from the very first one on. Also, our published books are on there. We're going to leave you now with a world champion whistler, Ann Kaufman, 
whistling Ave Maria. And have a blessed week. On behalf of Lenny and myself, Jay Sadie Gray, let's pray that soon the sun will rain. God bless you all in Jesus' name.